Hi guys, today I'm going to walk you through how to post to multiple social media accounts directly from Bubble. Bubble is a fantastic no-code platform that lets you create highly functional web apps really quickly and really simply. So I took a few of these Bubble elements and dragged it onto the page just to get us started. A multi-line input for the post body, another input for the photo URL, another input for the social destinations, and an image preview element that's connected to the photo URL. I also added a button that will allow the user to create the post. Now the next step is to connect all these elements to the Airshare social media API plugin and that will let us post content to our Twitter and Facebook accounts. The first step is to install the Airshare plugin from the Bubble Plugin Marketplace. You can click the install button and get the plugin for free. Airshare also has a free tier so you can get this up and running without any cost to really understand how all this comes together. The only thing that you need to do with this plugin is to put in your API key, which you can get from your Airshare API dashboard page. So I'm just gonna copy it over and remember to include the word bearer in front of the API key when you enter it into the plugin. Buffer auto saves the API key and now we can go back into the design and wire everything up. So we need to create one workflow to get this all working. If you click on the button and click start edit workflow, you're gonna be able to add an action to when this button is clicked. You can click the button that says click here to add an action, go down to plugins and select Airshare API post call. We do not need to change the content type. We do want to change the post body. So if you click in there, you can do insert dynamic data and select the multi-line input into the post body and then select the value for that. For platforms, we also want to insert dynamic data and we're going to select the input that has example Facebook and select the value for that. And then for the media, which is the image, we're gonna also insert dynamic data and select the input for the photo URL and select the value for that. Now we can go back to the app design and try it out. So let's click preview and run the app and create a post. I'm gonna to go to Unsplash to find a nice photo for our post. And why don't we pick this nice panda photo. I'm gonna right click and copy the photo address and paste it into the box for the photo URL. The image preview confirms that we have the right photo and I'm gonna put in some text. The panda is very hungry. Then I'm gonna select which destinations I wanna send it to. And today we're gonna to send it to Facebook and Twitter. And the way to type it in is to put Facebook in quotes, comma, space, and then Twitter in quotes. And Airshare supports many other destinations that you could check out uh, in the documentation. But for today, we're just gonna to post to the two platforms. Okay, now we have our post body, our image, our destinations, and we're gonna click post it. The progress bar at the top of the window is running. And there we go, it's complete. So let's take a quick look at our Twitter account. Just refresh the page. And there we have it, the panda is very hungry, fantastic. And let's take a quick look at our Facebook account. The panda is very hungry, there it is. And that's all there is to it. We put a couple of elements on the page, we wired up the button to the plugin, and now we're live. We have social media posting to multiple destinations in our Bubble app. We hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.